Hello everyone, welcome back. Rad mini step through. Splash. Bashed. So, we do it. We did go to the pool today. We were splash bashed. We had fun. I think we saw uh, a hula. There are some, they invited some people to do hula dancing. And we really enjoyed that. My youngest actually was excited and she got to hula a little bit herself. So we're done. What time is it? It's almost seven o'clock. I'm not sure when it ends. I think it almost I think it ends at seven or maybe eight. Anyways, the sun is setting. It's still warm. It's still warm. And we're done with the pool today. We're finished. That's I think this was the last time we went to the pool for the year. So we enjoyed it very much. My youngest was eyeing that uh, ice cream, ice cream truck again. She, I did buy her some ice cream, or popsicle, I should say. She bought a little minion. She wanted a the minion popsicle. It didn't last that long. It started melting right away. So I'm getting ready to go. We'll be taking off here so shortly. Let some people go by first. All right. There's the ice cream truck. Looks like a school bus. It's been very hot this summer. hoping for spring to come around or fall to come around soon so it cool down a little bit and when it gets too cold in the winter I'll be longing for the warm summer days again and the pool to be open it's a cycle a cycle of life all right got the little walk sign for me go around this person work my way up this incline going over the overpass a little bridge that goes over the uh, railroad I think a long time ago before they had this overpass people actually had to cross the railroad to get to the other side here golf course to the left Beautiful sunset, look at that. Sun setting out there to the, to the west there. My daughter's looking at it. She's enjoying the sunset as well. I'm just enjoying the ride enjoying the video. I'm not sure how long before she's too old to ride the We Ride co-pilot, but I think the maximum payload weight for the We Ride co-pilot is 70 pounds. I think she's 50 pounds right now, maybe 55. So it'll be a while before she reaches the maximum payload capacity for the We Ride co-pilot, which is 70 pounds. I'm not sure what we're gonna do. I'm hoping that she would like to ride a bike. I think riding the Rewrite Copilot with the electric Rad Mini step through does make it fun. Of course, she's not really putting any effort or energy. There's no energy she's putting into it. If she does pedal, it's, you know, she's just ghost pedaling for the most part. 
but I'm hoping she will take on a liking to riding a bike so she could go to school on her own. I'm not even sure if she knows how to ride a bike because I haven't really taught her. But I think whether your parents teach you or if you grow up and learn on your own, it's not really hard to ride a bike. I mean, once you learn, you never forget. What I usually do is, I'll, I'll probably buy her a brand new bike, but before I do that, I'll probably most likely find a bike that's being thrown away. It happens every year, all the time. Kids grow up, they stop riding bikes, they start taking the bus when they start going to middle school, high school, or you know, once they get into high school, they may even start driving. My oldest is already driving. She's got her learner's permit and once she turns 16 she'll be able to take the test to get her driver's license and she may be starting to drive on her own. So in my neighborhood trash day twice a week. Usually around the holidays is when I find people throw away like bicycles, grills, barbecue grills, um, some interesting things, you know, and I, and I might pick up some, some things here and there. Eventually what I do is I end up either recycling it, if it's metal, most likely it's going to get recycled, or it gets reused for a while until it, I can't fix it anymore or I have no more use for it, then I'll just end up throwing it away myself. So what's probably going to happen is I'll probably find a bike that works and just have her practice on it. And if she wrecks it or crashes it or dumps it, not a big deal. It's just something for her to practice on. And once she gets pretty good at it, I'll probably get her a new bike. She's probably going to want a new bike as she grows up older and older. You know, once you get to like the third, the fourth, the fifth grade, you, you kind of outgrow your your first and second and third grade bike. But for now, I, I think what I'm doing is is fine. I'm not really teaching her how to ride a bike, but I, I think she's getting a great experience from it, and she's definitely enjoying the re-ride co-pilot. <laughs> as long as it's attached to an electric bicycle like the Rad Mini step through I have here. And of course, I'm enjoying riding the bike, especially the electric bike here. Again, the Rad Mini step through. I bought it just just for this to pull the Reride Copilot and also to have other family members use it. Who knows, maybe my youngest as she grows up, she'll start riding the re-ride, not the re-ride co-pilot, but the, uh, the Rad Mini step-through. It's shorter, the seat height is lower. So far, my wife has ridden the Rad Mini step-through. My oldest daughter has. She had to go somewhere and I couldn't give her a ride. And it was within the neighborhood. I just told her to take the electric bicycle. And she did. Most likely she just throttled. So overall, you know, this bike was a good purchase for me. It's a multi-use family electric bicycle. I definitely use it. I use it for this particular case just to pull the rear right co-pilot. It does have a front basket and a front rack. Well, it's uh, the front rack, and then there's just the basket, which I could, I don't have a rear rack on this. But eventually, when time comes, when I don't need to pull the rewrite co-pilot anymore, I, I'll uh, modify the rewrite co-pilot to a storage trailer, or a trailer that can pull or haul stuff. 
It is a steel frame, so I have a welder. I can probably do something with it. I want to convert the Rewrite Copilot to a trailer that also carries my kayak. So look forward to that day. And then, who knows, maybe I'll sell it, get a Rad Runner. Probably not. Rad Runner is not really my style. But uh, the Rad Runner is another bicycle, electric bicycle from Rad Power Bikes. Basically, it is a Rad Mini step through frame with a rack and kind of looks like a, you know, those taco bikes, banana bikes, similar to like Super 73 or Juice Scrambler. But that's in the future, who knows what I'll do. Maybe my youngest will ride it. That's the bike she wants to ride because it's so much easier. She could just throttle. If we live here, the middle school is very close. Matter of fact, I think we, we might have even passed. Yeah, we did pass it. We passed the middle school. So it's possible if she does go to middle school and she does want to ride or continue to ride her bike or ride an electric bike, she may use the Rad Mini Step Through to do that. And why not? You know, why not? That's why I bought it to be used. And of course, I have my other bicycles. I have the, the regular Rad Mini 2018 model, which I think, I think has better torque and more power than the newer versions of the 2019 model, in my opinion. Matter of fact, I did a video on that. It's called the, it's called Rad Power Bikes versus Hill. You may want to do a search on it. I tested the Rad Rover, the Rad Mini, and the Rad Mini Step Through going up the the hill in my or the amphitheater. And uh, it, the front part of the hill is about 10% grade. The back part is 15. And the Rad Mini 2018 model was the only one that made it up on both sides of the hill on throttle alone. The Red Rover just died. <laughs> I mean, it's it's because of the larger wheels. The Red Mini step through was surprising. It made it up the 10% grade, but couldn't quite make it all the way up on the 15% grade. It's very comparable to the regular Red Mini. It's the controllers are different. I think that's the main difference. Anyways, I'm almost home. Almost home. Let's enjoy the music and the ride.
Well, I hope you all enjoyed that ride and enjoyed the music there. I did. Looks like the ride is almost done. Kids having fun. Looks like somebody else had a little splash splash of their own. Anyways, thanks for watching, everybody. Please like, share, comment, and don't forget to subscribe if you like this video. Thanks for watching, everybody. Bye.